good morning and welcome back to my channel well we haven't really been doing much we've just been preparing for the winter months i mean it's november and i mean look it's a beautiful day in november a bit chilly not freezing or anything but it is a bit chilly we're going into town to just meet up with some friends i've got a lesson today at eight and so I'm just going to make some, well, I'm not a professional, but when I was living in Greece, I liked um, espresso fredo metrio. And for any Greek people out there, if I'm saying it wrong, I do apologise. And if I'm making it wrong, I do apologise. So I put my coffee and a little bit of sugar in here. And now I'm just going to add a little bit of water. I don't have my stand with me so I can't really so I'm gonna fill I think about that much of water so I'm gonna put it down here guys yep that's my t-shirt check it out so let's have a look <laughs> Sorry, oh, that's what it kind of is going to look like. And then just top it up a little bit more with water. So basically, that's done. It's cold coffee, which is really neat. It's um, hit and miss when I make it. I've got a very good friend in, in uh, Kalimnos that makes it very, very well. I always go to her house. But she used to be a barrister anyway. Well, yeah, she used to work in a coffee shop, so she's very good. So, while he's up having a shower, I'm going to see if I can... And when you drink it, drink it with the thin straws, because I was using it with um, the thick straw. And, uh, you know, that was not a good idea. So I've been using it with... Um, probably not doing it right. But as I said, it's hit and miss, and sometimes it's okay and sometimes it's not. Get. I cannot get the straw steady. Right. That's it. Looks okay, but we'll see. Uh, so so. So as I said, we haven't really been doing much today. This um, past few months, um, Les has been helping out. Um, friends that are moving, moving house. I've been started working again. I had a knee injury. I still got a knee injury actually, and um, but it's not as bad as it was. So I've been doing my own physio on it. I've been like doing some strengthening exercises on it, and taking some um, health herbal tablets, and it seems to be working. It's certainly not as bad as it was. Um, obviously I can't dance around in it properly yet but it is certainly not as bad I do wear a brace during the day on my knee and then in the night I take it off and I take the tablet every day the herbal tablet and then I do the knee strengthening exercises every day and that's certainly helped without a doubt it's helped so that's good so we're on our way out so um, if I can take some videos and shots Oh, most of the tourists have gone home. Bob's gone. There's his friend has gone back to Norway. A couple of the expats are preparing to go back to the UK for Christmas, spend Christmas with their families. Other expats are obviously still here. We didn't go out for Halloween. I was working. And to be honest, I didn't really fancy going out. Um, I had a costume which was a uh, cat woman but honestly I look like in it and I was like oh no I'm not wearing that 
It was kind of funny though. Anyway, oh, this is what I'm wearing today. Nothing spectacular. Just a t-shirt and yellow trousers. These yellow trousers, sorry if you can't see them. These yellow trousers, I got them from Kalimnas in Missouri, uh, the climbers shop. And um, the quality is absolutely fantastic. It's amazing quality. So, uh, obviously you can get great quality climbing stuff for wherever you are, New York, America, blah, 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 the UK. But if you're in Greece, if you're in Kalimnas, for sure, because it's a mountain, you know, lots of climbers go to there. It's very popular for climbers. Uh, do pop into the shops there. They've got great quality um, climbing clothes. Well, they have to be, don't they, really? So, yeah, that's it. So, guys, um, not much else going on. Oh, Les has started taking up walking football which he despised before, but now he says it's really good and he loves it. But now he's got a bit of an injury himself. Oh, us old people, once you get an injury, it's really difficult as you're getting older to, for it to heal. It takes, it takes longer to heal, so you've got to be really careful. I try to do stretches every morning, and then in the evening I do whatever exercises I can. Because of my knee, I can't go jogging like I used to and so next year I want to try to get into the gym and uh, really start building up my strength again but for now at least I'm doing something stretching in the morning 20 minutes it's nothing and then in the afternoon or the evening especially uh, after I've eaten and then I do abs glutes uh, it varies every evening varies so I might do like yesterday what did I do last night last night I did glutes, abs, and I did my leg exercises. So I tried to change it every evening, but I'll do a video where what I'm doing, the programs that I'm doing, it does vary quite a bit. So I shall leave you for now. Thank you for watching. It's only a short video. And um, just show you some pictures of where we were today, where we're going. And that's it. Hope you have a lovely day wherever you are. Keep smiling. Everything will be alright. See you later. Bye.